Hi everyone, my name is Manisha and welcome back to my channel. So today's reading is for Taurus and Sign and for the month February 2022. Your cards are right in front of you, so let's see what kind of energy, messages and suggestions you should be following or you should follow in this particular month. Well, for the starting of the month, I got this card. Pentacles. Well, uh, Taurus, it seems like this month is starting on a note where uh, eventually or after analysis, you have to decide that there's a lot to learn and you have to keep continuing your hard work. Even if in the past you have earned a lot of, you know, recognition, a lot of hard work you have done in the past. But what I can see right now is that whatever you are doing or wherever you are right now, this thing, this project, this job or this scenario require you to enhance your skills to work on your skills this is not the point where you should sit and think that i have done enough now you know this is the way i will do the work this is not gonna be like this if you really wanted to be successful if you really wanted to uh, achieve something more in your life then definitely you have to work on your skills and if only you do this then definitely i can see that recognition is there in your future Hard work will definitely pay off to you. So, yes, don't be, a, you know, a, don't feel that, you know, you have achieved a lot. That's fine that you have achieved. You, you can be proud of it. But as we say, life goes on. You have to work according to your situations, according to your skills and according to your uh, priorities and this point of time need different kind of uh, skills and strategies the old strategies whatever you have experienced in past things have changed so now you also have to change world is changing so just keep doing it keep that how hard work going on being a taurus definitely you're a hard working person so keep doing that. Keep keep working on your skills. What new I can do? What uh, innovative I can do in my work? So keep thinking like that. Then comes the middle of the month. And for the middle of the month, I got two cards again. Okay, the lowest card and the king of pentacles. Well, for some of you, maybe you will be meeting a good connection in your life the reason why i'm saying good connection that means it's in your hand to take it forward yes this person is good this person is someone uh, whom you can trust he or she is a trustworthy person but again the only thing that i wanted to point out over here is that just because a person is honest just because a person is good have manners doesn't mean that this person is gonna be uh, good for you as well so even if you're meeting someone keep your mind and eyes open and then analyze whether you can take this relationship or this connection forward or not but definitely you will be meeting someone uh, who's having a good potential then for some of you this will be a phase where you will be getting the reward of your hard work see this is what i was talking about starting of the month is a phase where you know you have to keep continuing your work and over here the king of pentacle it shows that you know your hard work will not go in vain it's not like that that nobody will notice you people are noticing you people will notice you if you 
continue your hard work. There are two types of people, especially in the work areas. One, who are quite experienced and they don't want to, uh, you know, in include anything new. But then there are people who are experienced yet they are more energetic. They, they are more open towards new things in their life. And these are the people, organizations value. Just think about it. Definitely. Uh, so far, I can see that this month is bringing a lot of good energy in your life. So keep doing it. Keep giving your best part and just be honest in your work. Whatever you're giving right now to, towards the universe, you're about to receive it. And you're about to receive it very soon. So just keep doing the hard work. Keep doing the good work. And just be positive. Then comes the end of the month. And for the end of the month, again, pentacles. A lot of pentacles in your reading. And the moon card. Taurus, uh... Over here, I can see that in the end of the month, maybe you will receive some sort of a good news, which looks like a good news. Or maybe someone will try to approach you, wanted to contact you. But over here, I would like to warn you against such person because whatever, your, whatever information you're getting or whatever... Uh, I would say proposal you're getting it's it's a little bit malicious I mean something is wrong in it so if you're going ahead with this or if you feel that okay this is what I got this is what I dreamed of and now I wanted to uh, take it ahead please go through each and every thing each and every clause of this proposal project or job or whatever information it is it's coming from a place which is not good, which is not good for you. So don't trust this person. Don't trust this person. They have wrong intentions for you. Or maybe they just wanted to create some haze around you and manipulate you. So don't get manipulated. This is what I'm talking about in the end of the month. So yeah, just be a little careful about it. On the whole, this month is quite in your favor. And you know, there are times when we are doing good, when everything is going fine, we are working hard, we have everything that we always wanted in our life. That is the moment where when the people who don't like us or people who are jealous around us want to create some, some sort of tension or irritation in our life. Just be careful with such people. The best way is to whatever you're hearing from them, block it or avoid it. Simple as that. The very moment you block it or avoid it, it's gone. That, that negativity is gone. So your positivity is completely in your hands. So that's all from my side for the month of February. For Taurus, thank you so much. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.